Are you just joshing? You guys? You guys? 24, 27, 20, okay, well. You and then guys. Rob can bring in one of his pooter friends because he has no <laughs> pets. He's like, I have no, I have no pets, but none, I have spooder friends. I have none pets, but I am <laughs> a spooder. Yum 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 yum. You're getting crits and it's fun. We don't get those here. This has only been like my fifth one, at the very most. We are a non-critting team here. All right, so I can get back in the fray. We cannot get back in the fray. Why aren't you seizing the boy? I'm afraid to drink this because I feel like I'm misjudging how hot it really is. Oh, yeah. We're sending Jill to deal with archers. My goodness. I wouldn't. <laughs> Here's a scary mercenary. Three damage, okay. Mercen. Yeah, my. The, in my house. My house. You know, like many other houses, they have the little, the little small spiders that just kind of wander around in the corners. They keep in their own business. But sometimes they don't keep to their own business. You see them sort of just randomly descend or they start bothering like my sister in the bathroom or something. And that's when they, you know... Or me when they start descending above my head. Yeah, and that's that's just them giving up their opportunity to have free rent. <laughs> see, Rob will let them live here, live here peacefully as long as they stick to their corners. You guys stay... And the ceiling. You guys hang out... Nice crib, boy. You guys that's just do your what, thing. Six? Maybe, yeah. You just do your thing, but the second you guys leave your corner, guys, we talked about this. Crumple. And I vacuumed them all. Because <laughs> I no like them anywhere, Newman. I've gotten better over the years about handling spiders. Like before, it was like. <laughs> Latimer, was that one of your supporter friends? It is that they are giving up the free trial in life. They were, they were allowed to live completely rent-free, and they chose death. It's not my fault. There's nothing I can do about it. I'm sorry. I just leave the spiders to him, because... I was in bed still, and my sister's, like, calling down. She was getting ready for work. And, and my sister just calls down to, like, my mom. She's like, Mom, can you come upstairs? She goes, like, what? And my mom, like, thinks that, like, something's wrong. She goes, there's a spider in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> she goes, like, okay. And she goes, can you come kill it? Like, my sister won't kill them. She's so terrified of them. Yeah, it was, like, two in the morning. And we were visiting my grandma in rural, rural Mexico. Rural, rural. rural Mexico. Um, there's big, creepy crawlies there. Ugh, pardon me. I don't blame you, Caleb. And so, my room, so the way that my, my grandma designed and built her own house, and the way that she had designed it was kind of like, my dad's bedroom had like an, an alcove at the top, which was my bedroom, because we rarely visited at the same time, but it was, it was also built when we were, we were much younger, so it was kind of like, I had my own balcony, and the bed was actually built into the wall. So it was, it was even like asymmetrical, it had custom made sheets, like it was, it was this really cool place. And then each room had its own bathroom. My brother's room was in the room next over, which was the guest bedroom, and up in the alcove as well. And there was a giant spider in the bathroom, it's like two in the morning, and I just like held my breath, backed away slowly, and when I mm. woke up my brother at two in the morning, I'm like, yeah, and he's like, what? And I'm like, there's a spider in the bed. And he's like, oh, and I'm like, can you come kill it? He's like, what time is it? I'm like, I need help. It doesn't please. matter. He's like, okay. And uh -oh. like, Jenny, you're facing death again. <clears throat> so he Ooh. came, he, he came to like kill it, got it. And he's like sleepwalking pretty much, and he like, killed it and everything at this point i'm like about to pee my pants because <laughs> i just have to go but I, I can't and i also wouldn't go to another bathroom because i was terrified that if i was away for too long i would lose track of it mm. and i wouldn't know where it went and so he got it and everything and then i like behind the toilet and everything I'm, like lifting and i was like oh and i was just terrified even like using the bathroom anyway and then he woke up in the morning he's like yeah i had this dream that you woke me up and i was like no i did no i definitely Thanks. did <laughs> he's like oh okay 
Latimer was my jumping spider. Salticus, Senius, friendly jumping spider. Oh, okay. It was a wee baby. A winter because. Ooh. Oh, man. Simicus. Yeah. Okay. I mean, you could be like all cool with spiders and everything, right? But the moment you find one that's like, just like, hey, you're putting on some socks and one crawls out, no, sir. Oh, my no, God. No, sir. Nope. Right away. Oh. Awful, awful, awful things. Oh, my God. I'm just giving me heebies. Yeah, I think like probably one. Oh. <clears throat> I always, so when I lived in Cancun, bugs just get in all the time. <laughs> Back here, I feel that. Um, every morning, I would, before I put on my shoes, your, your, I wouldn't even, shoes? my shoes, I wouldn't even like shake it out. I would like pick it up and drop it really quickly just to see if anything like dropped to the bottom of it. And then I would do that like about two or three times. And then if nothing. Yay. Oh, that's so creepy. Yeah, I always like shook out. Not even shook. I just like banged my shoes onto the floor and just like made sure that nothing was in it. I was like, okay, we're good. Oh, good. What the hell is this? A very big boat. Are those all shaman? Wizards. Okay. Oh, look. They look like the Jawas. They are Jawas. Yo, wait. Is that a shaman in the back? I couldn't tell. It's a it's a rough um, it's a rough uh, rough CEO here. Wizard. Wizard. Okay. With recover and Dora. I don't know what Dora's supposed to mean. I'm unfamiliar with that name. That's of the why spell. I wore a lot of flip flops. Recover and Dora. They all have recover. They and Dora. can't they can't hide in the flip flops. So they're all mages, are they? All right. You no, no, get, you they're guys, wizards. The wizards, you're right. You guys want to have a magic battle? Let's freaking do it. Zeke, do you remember those like um? Plastic. Jenny called. Like bobbles that had rings inside of them, and then they were like in those almost like a big bubble gum machine, but it was just of like little prices. Um, I got, I really wanted like this pretty ring that was in one of them. Oh, that was a bad. I should have done it here so that there's more of them. Mm. Oops. I almost want to restart just for that. Mm. Ugh. Oh! <laughs> Gross. I don't even want to know what they look like. Oh, she touch it with her tail. No. Ah! Mm. Yeah. <gasps> Magic battle, let's go. <laughs> you know what? Celica's got good resistance. She can smack these things. Yeah, like the gumball machines, but they're they're not the gumball ones. They're like the ones that have actual plastic bobbles in, that have prizes inside of them. They're like really, really big ones. Um. I wanted this really pretty ring that was in one of them, and of course, I was never gonna get that. But I got a different ring with spider on it. Ugh. Like, not a real one. Yeah. They're all healing each other despite them being at full health. Mm. Our boat is just having a rough sail. Mm. But, um, so of course, it's like it's the ugly one, and it's, I'm like, it's fine. I've worn like spider rings for you know if if I dressed up as oh, a witch for Halloween spider or something. Ring. I thought it was an actual spider. No, no, like that's why I said like a fake one, the okay. plastic oh, ones. I didn't catch that. Okay. Um, but I was just like, okay, whatever. I wasn't great, like crazy about it or anything. But then the next day I woke up, and I I woke up with my ring beside me, like beside my face, and. I was just like, okay, and then I just like put, I cupped my hand over top of it. No, no. And then my half asleepness, I went, I'm like, wait a second. I wasn't wearing my ring and I didn't leave it on the bed. And I don't know, like, I must have had some sort of sense that it wasn't actually my ring because I didn't just like keep my hand flat on it. I had cupped it and lo and behold, I lift my hand and it's walking. I have never shot out of a bed faster. And I'm like, <sighs> like, and of course it's like early, well, I don't know how early in the morning it was because I used to wake up at like two in the afternoon. I was, I must have been around seven or eight years old. And I just, like, I'm 
screeching across the house, running into my mom's bedroom. She's like, with bloody murder. And she's like, what just happened? And I'm like, there's a spit! It was like, it was this oh, close to my face. God, that's and I'm like, waking up like, where is it? That's your, you're from like what? South Africa? Am, am I making that up? I don't know. <laughs> it's probably too cold, but they have, na they're nasty. Ooh. Why do I feel like South Africa is? Actually, so far, yeah. Nicaragua, right, okay. Yeah, I was way off. I was, Jesus <laughs> yeah, I was Christ. Yeah, like, I don't, like, South Africa does not like, ring a bell. I, no, it just came up in, like, in thought one time, Vatu, where I was like, where exactly is Vatir from? Nicaragua. And for some reason, I was thinking South Africa, but, you know, well, right, fair enough. Yes, Tiny? I used to work with the guy from Nicaragua. Just hang on your bathroom towel when you were... <laughs> Ugh, centipedes are the worst. Hey, no, man. Zeke said, like, honestly, it's one of my favorite stories about that, because it's, like, when people misunderstand why I'm so freaked out by spiders, I'm like, you need to understand. I felt like death was coming for me. Oh, yeah, for sure. I just so happened that my, like... I cupped my hand over it and I'm oh, like, Wah. yeah, that's brutal. Oh, I'd scream too. I lose my shit. Like, I have no Ooh, problem really tiny, like against goodness. spiders, right? Like, like I don't really have a problem with them, but I don't, I don't, I don't want one on me. Yeah. I don't want one near me. Like, if I see one crawling on the floor, I'll, I will burn it. The whole house is coming down. Did you see what? If like I see one crawling on the floor, like near me. A spider? Yeah. Oh, everything. Like, a, like a. Not like one of those little shitty ones. No, like Australian ones. Australian ones are freaking like they're monsters. They fight. They fight Godzilla. Yeah, yeah, like I've seen the ones that just like the I think it's the hunter spiders. I believe they're not venomous, but like they're so large that they just like hide themselves in sand and I'm just like yeah, <laughs> and I'm like what do you mean? You're just like hiding, hiding, hiding. It's like it's like I play hide and seek. <laughs> but you know which ones don't creep me out? Peacock spiders. I say that now. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. As long as it's not a spider, please don't do that. Don't send her spider. She'll freaking scream. <laughs> I'll pour my tea on you. <laughs> on you. By don't accident. do it on me. <laughs> not on purpose. I'll freak. All right, Jenny. Tank the shit. Got a girl. Drops a big female rose hair tarantula off my arm on the floor. Yeah, absolutely. See, my grade four through five... Spanish teacher. She was my neighbor. And I lived in Cancun twice. I lived in Cancun for, I believe it was a year when I was between three and four. And then, and she was my neighbor then. And then when I returned, when I was 12, no, eight, sorry. Um, is it animal related, Caleb? If it is, put it in the uh, Pokemon channel. Mm hmm. Yeah, if it's animal related, put it in the Pokemon channel. But if not, just put it in the general. Or the Pokemon Center, yeah. rather. Yeah, just put it in general then. Or, or actually put it in random crap. Put it in random crap. Sure. Or random shit or whatever I called it. I don't know. I think it's random crap. Is that guy low HP? 27, not really. They are. So, that neighbor of mine who turned out to be my teacher eventually had pet spiders. And by spiders, I mean tarantulas. Ugh. So her husband, and I didn't know this at the time because, of course, I was like three and four. And by the time I returned being eight, I'm like, I don't really remember this person. My mom's like, yeah, this is Norma. Like, she was our neighbor and stuff. And I was like, okay. And she's like, yeah, you remember her husband? Um, he like he used to have the, the pet tarantulas. Yeah. And I was like, uh, yeah, I remember him. So tarantulas, for some reason, his tarantulas always wanted to walk towards the pool. So he used to take them outside and just have them on his hands, and they would walk on his hands, always wanting to go towards the pool. And I, I have that vivid memory, and I was just like, oh, okay. Well, it turns out, I went to Montessori school, so it's, it wasn't like a regular classroom. The teachers had these big round tables that we went to sit at when we had class with them. Because the, the, we essentially had like multiple different classes in the same classroom. But we had our own desks for when we were doing independent work. Well, my desk was very close to hers. And as it turns out, one day, because, you know, cockroaches in Mexico are not this big. When, when you know, you see one that's this big here, people are like, oh my god, it's an adult. 
it's this big and it flies, okay? That's what a tropical cockroach does. It flies at you. So anyway, you have to have regular uh, pest control to make sure that since, you know, it's very warm and, you know, it's very humid, that your house is under control. It's a normal thing. <laughs> so one of these days, she's having her little pest control routine and they're doing a spraying, which means that they have to leave the house and, of course, having tarantulas... She can't leave her tarantulas at home. I wouldn't. So for a week, she brought them to school. I just noticed that Jenny's only doing one damage. Mm. It's fine. Battle of attrition. No, don't go back to heal, you fools. So she had these two tarantulas in her little travel cage on her desk. This is already bad news. <laughs> right beside my desk. And here's our arachnophobic little me going... And they're like, Itzy, you're not paying attention. Itzy, are you doing your work? And I'm like, I can't do spiders. <laughs> no, like, I'm just like catatonic. And then in grade five, we go to the jungle for our annual camp. So we always like, oh, yeah. our annual class trip was always to a different place. And in grade five, we went to, literally to the middle of a jungle. All fine and dandy and stuff. Yeah, there's nothing fine and dandy about that. No, sure it was. <laughs> Not for me. Actually, I think you would have liked it. In the jungle? No. Yes. Spiders and insects and nature and humidity it's, and it's, blah. It's different than what you think. There was like pools and cenotes. Like, I think you would have liked it. Anyway, point sign. The thing is, she runs out of the bathroom, like out of the showers, screaming bloody murder. And... who? We're all like, what kind of monster has gone to her? It was a butterfly. She was deathly afraid of butterflies. And I'm looking at her and I'm like, Norma, you have tarantulas for pets. <laughs> She's like, yeah? And I'm like, they have eight legs. These ones have six and they're pretty. And she's like, Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> like I guess because they fly and she, and it was a large one. I, I will say it was quite large. Ooh, I like butterflies. Yeah, this one was an owl butterfly, so a lot of people oh. confuse them for moths. But our bu owl but butterflies are quite misunderstood because a lot <laughs> of the times people think they're really really ugly because the outside is very plain. But the inside is beautiful. Me too, Vazir. A little bit, yeah. I worked at a butterfly conservatory, so I worked with um, uh, butterflies from the Indo-Australian region, which are, like, huge. And I loved it. And I remember, like, one of my favorite things to do was helping, like, people get comfortable around them. But it always reminded me of Norma, because for all my friends and I, like, butterflies were normal. It was just because you're always surrounded by them. So I had never met anyone that was afraid of butterflies, and I would have never guessed it from someone that had tarantulas. And it just, I mean, now I'm a lot more empathetic about it, but it is funny because even all of my classmates, they might have been creeped out about the spiders and stuff, but they were okay because they were in, in their cage. For me, it's like I just had flashes of them just breaking out of their thing and it like crawling on me and it was like, oh! Oh, Zeke, she has so many stories and pictures and everything from the butterfly land. Ooh, Zika's, I'll send you so many pictures. Except loud sounds. Loud sounds are terrifying, you know? That's, yeah, that's, that's, that's a phobia, yeah. Loud, I was scared of loud sounds too, actually. I remember, you know, my family was like, New Year's, and there's a little fireworks. Firecrackers, like yeah. And the fireworks always, I was really, oh, I learned angel magic. Angel magic? Yeah, I just learned it. Ooh, <laughs> so bam. I learned it. Now I go slob the dagger. There you go. Oh, oh I yes, wonder, yes, yes, Caleb. Let me I take I wonder look. if that's meant to be uh, Seraphim. Possibly. How much mana does it cost? 4 HP. Mana. Let's see what it looks like. In slow motion. Let's see. Look, let's see, look at the... Wee -wee 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 -wee. The little they're pixies. Like, uh, I was going to say they're like teeny Bam. fairies. Am I going to die? Uh, right I'm an there. idiot. That's what for? I'm an. Yeah, now I gotta do all that again. Oh, Angel is called Seraphim. Dun, da, 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 I gotta dun, do dun, all dun, that dun. again just to see the slow motion <laughs> thing. 
Oh, sorry. Yeah, let me turn no. that around. Oh, god damn it. Eh. Oh, there we go. Oh, I. Mm. Yes, try again. Lil said she was the only known blue eyed. Wow. Leucistic. Leucistic King Cobra in the world. Oh, wait a second. Is this. I feel like you've maybe sent pictures of this before. Oh, I'm really sorry to hear that, Zeke. <gasps> who is this SNCC? Specifically, is this belongs it, to somebody you know, or is this in like a conservatory or something? I would imagine that this was probably in captivity somewhere. Like maybe in in a zoo or in a in a rip. Yeah. Rip uh, uh, um, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, th I'm like that. Uh, hmm. Yeah, I think if, if it's the one that I recall seeing, it was very pretty. I think snakes are super rad, but I mean, I just don't know if I'd want one around me. Like, on you? Maybe like a small, like, chill one. Like, maybe? Like Noodle! But like... Little Prince! Maybe I'd want like a... But like the super big ones, I'd like... Reptile I'd like scream. <clears throat> Jimmy's yeah, the best. I Jesus I would imagine best. that would be the case. Jimmy's the best. It's like you know what, like some people have such an open mindedness for. Oh god. Let's see, Prince. Like I don't know. I think Prince might be too small. I want like maybe bigger than Prince, but like we're not talking boa constrictor either. You know what I mean? Like, no. More like a garden snake, maybe. I like the, like the like the king cobras are cool. Like that's like that size. That's size. Okay. Like you know. But the like, King Cobra's like probably not the best pets in the world. I was so. gonna say I love how you go with like small chill one and goes like King Cobra? Yeah, just give me this freaking listener <laughs> snake charming or something. I did, yes I did. Cause like too small, like it would be really difficult to track. I don't know, I think they're so cute. No, they're cool. Like I've always liked snakes. My mom holy shit. My mom's okay, right off the top of your head, I already sorta of spoiled one, but name the okay maybe what are the small cobras what are the small cobras <laughs> the small ones what are they called rob's like yeah king cobra is good what place. are the small ones the small ones what are they what are they called how about a, a rattlesnake how about that chill for you yes <laughs> okay they're cough no it's it's the queen cobra skin and for medusa and smite sure but still also cough jungle book Snake, oh. Or any rattlesnake in any lore ever, pretty much. Yeah, excuse me, sir, can you get off the heel tile, please? <laughs> please. You fuck. <laughs> Salika. Girl. Get better. Don't worry, Jenny will just... Yeah, I don't know, like... the co I like the cobra-type things, because like, they're freaking... I, I like Egyptian stuff. I Chapter guess. 17 going good. Excellent. So what do you think my mom's like three most hated animal creatures are? Snake. Snake's one of them. Cockroach? Probably, but I mean uh, Probably. It's like top three, but probably. Top three, but other ones. Spider. She's probably not well, no, she because she'll just for her a Rabbit. spider, it's like she sees a spider, she's getting the freaking Schnella, and she's going to murder that <laughs> thing, you know? Mm, okay, well, snake for sure. Yep. Turtles. Turtles, no. I don't know how she feels about turtles. Okay, frogs. I don't know how she feels about frogs, no. Is anyone close to level? Oh, she'll, she sees a mouse, she gets that broom boy, and there's no, no going back. The whole family's dying. Blank le- oh okay, no. Okay, I'm not attacking with Selica this time. Not a blank level up. I'm not attacking with Selica. Unless she dies again. Correct. Y you are a fool. No, my mom hates crocodiles. I that was gonna be my guess Snakes too. and bears. Okay. She can't stand bears. She thinks they're the world's most like number one like murderer of like everything you go camping in the forest like, bears are gonna come get you I'm like, what do you Man. mean they're big cuddly things you see them playing horns in russia 
Yeah. I mean, a there's Yogi a, Bear a, did there's her There's a video of a, of, a, like, a bear yeah. sitting sidecar in, like, a motorcycle, and he's got, like, a vuvuzela, and, and the guy in the car, he hears, he honks the horn, and the bear goes, <laughs> Oh, more, oh, man. Only in Russia, though. Okay, so any color, color bread would be good. Prince should get about three to five feet in the next year or two. That's manageable size to hold, and their bites feel like your fingernails tapping on your skin. Die. That's pretty good. Gee, it's most huggable. Right? Well, I don't know about crocodiles being so huggable. There we go. My uncle accidentally sat on, uh, sat on a crocodile. Of all that is holy save. Okay, now we can go get the dagger because he got the angel magic. Great. My uncle sat on a crocodile. Really? Yeah. When he was a kid at a zoo and got out of its enclosure and he thought it was a log. Ooh. <laughs> and he sat on it until he goes. <laughs> Oh, look, look, this is, this is Run Village, right? This is where Alm's crew, so Alm's crew is over here. Uh-huh. So now we're playing, I guess Alm is on the way up still. So yep. Selica's doing her thing, and we're going to meet up. After you and kill the, the then, dark and dragon. And then Alm and Selica, they're going to see each other, and they're going <laughs> to... <laughs> yeah, my uncle sat on a crocodile at a zoo. Wow. Yeah, when he was a kid. Let's see if we can take out He the, also ate poop. Let's see if so. we can take out the, your uncle. Yeah, my uncle. He thought it was chocolate. Oh, dear. Yeah, it was a very dumb kid. Your uncle? Yeah. And then here. Not the brightest kid. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can get that dagger. You know, if you don't recruit certain units with all of them, can come get them. Well, uh -huh. I got nothing to worry about. Alright, Jenny, you know the job. Jenny. Summon. Sum sum. Now we have angel magic. They've redacted. With Selica? My uncle is definitely on another level. Both my uncles, it's like... They're the three stooges, but there's only two of them. So they Your have... uncle is two of three stooges? No. Oh. two. Of, I have two uncles. Uh -huh. It's three stooges packed into two. So each of them is the one and a half stooges. I see. That's the level of stooge. <laughs> yeah. I should know, I'm gonna bring Valbar up there too to help. He also tank. almost peed on my mom's bed. Not, almost peed on my mom's bed when he was sleepwalking. Yeah. Your uncle was a troubled man. <laughs> he was a child. Like both both my uncles sleptwalked. They were just. <laughs> yeah, it's his uncles on a different planet. Like... Actually, he's in Japan. A different planet then. Yes, he got married there. Well, he, he, well, not there, but he got married to someone there, and now he lives in Japan. Cool. He also went to. The United States of America when he was 18 America. on a scholarship for tennis. And so he studied there. All right, and then he just lived in Colorado until he got married and moved to Japan like three years ago or four look, years look ago. At the, or look at the drag zomb. <laughs> yeah, Zeke's my uncle's on a completely different plane. We gotta do this quick before the dragon starts flanking our boys. So now all of our guys are going to surround him. Because these soldiers are brainless. And would you like to try the chocolate one? Oh boy, I got adult beverage and water and coffee. And Drink it before it gets okay, totally cold. Right. And hold the tab. Or I hold the tab. Okay. Okay. I would try this one with a little bit of some form of like probably oat milk and, and like yeah, turn it into around. almost like a yeah like like a chocolate milky creamy thing. We got this thing. around. We got this around. Surround us here. Good, 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 good. Which guys on the brink of dying? I think it says all of them pretty much. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're all at six. So angel magic, very good on. Is it three range? Let's see. No, it's two range. Okay. Here we go. Angel. Oh, ghosts are fire. Oh, no. Tea party. Cleanse the evil dragon. 22 damage, huge. No, run. I can't. I know. Uh, <laughs> I think she can survive a hit, though. Would it attack her, though? Well, it's the dragon's turn now, anyway. And dragon's going to be attacking one of the guys. because. No, well, that's block. what I was wondering. I wasn't so, sure if it yeah. attacked any more than melee range. No, I forgot that the... 
It's 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 player enemy green allies right. or NPCs or whatever, so that's fine. Speed it up, please. So now long as so long as Celica hits, then Dagrin goes down. Oh she should hit. Alright, Celica. Get him. This is your sworn duty. Duty. Uh look at that. Ninety five hit chance maybe? Boom, there we go. Necro Dragon. That seems like a fitting Dagrin down. Left the Holy Ring. Took the Holy Ring. Dragon's Drugs on the conquered. It's a drug symbol. Hell yeah, we got the dagger. Woo! We got the ring. Store. Swap. Holy ring on Celica, which means she can heal more, which means she can spam magic, which means, yeah. Sure, we'll leave it on her. And we'll, we'll save. And with that, folks, we're going to call it a stream. Thanks for joining us. And Everybody, for hydrating thanks us. Thanks for hanging up. Hydrate. Yeah, hydration is important. Everybody, all of you. How's the Canadian weather? Today was okay. I don't okay. know what would make you ask such a thing. Today was okay, but uh, tomorrow morning, so Saturday morning and overnight, it's supposed to go to a negative 33 with a wind chill Celsius. Tomorrow morning? Yeah. Oh. Negative 33 with wind chill tomorrow morning. Let's give you those promotional points. Promotional points? Prediction oh. points. That was zero to five. Hydrate more. There you go, folks. We get to see the big winners. Oh, we didn't even have the prediction at the bottom? No, because it disappears once the voting is done. Oh. There you go. Ah, Jenner's with 3,000. Nah, losing again. <laughs> I just, I donate. That's all I do. Protect baby Yoda. There you go. It's it showing everybody, everyone winning, everyone wow. losing. Wow. Even Putin believing. Putin's a believer. I'm a and the magical 69% winner. Kidding. I was on the other but team. But we did get three rewinds, three resets, four resets. We did good today. Yeah, we did some progress. Jeez. Like, what do we got left? Maybe one more map? Maybe with Celica? Oh. With Celica, maybe? Uh, whatever this town is. You think that's a map? Um, I don't know. I mean, we'll find out. Maybe we can just jump to yeah, that. Yeah, right Joe, now. what would make you ask let's, such let's a thing? Let's jump to that right now. Let's see. We, okay. Let's see. Let's, let's zip over there. Do I look cold by any by any chance? No. For any reason? No. No, not at all. No. Because if that's just a conversation, then we'll just zip through. Excellent really quick. jacket design. No hood, but giant neck. Because why wouldn't I want a hood? Okay, yeah, there was no. Or why would I want a hood, cool. right? All right, off the why, port. Why, why would I not Shush want to you. keep my <laughs> shoulders up to my ears to keep warm? <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's not. Oh, hi, Paula. Oh, hello. You sure did. Oh, we came from Arcanea. A continent to, to the east. Ah. Game even tells you. Mm hmm. Because, like, in case you don't know, which you wouldn't, because it's a new game. Oh, she has a deeper voice. That's right. Oh, she, she even looks pissed. <clears throat> She's like, Our little sister was taken by pirates. We gave chase, but lost them around here. All right, so Est is missing. Mm. Of course she is. Of I, course I, she is. I go to bed now. Okay, good night. Okay, good night. Good night. Save in the bed. No, by the way. There we go. Any hidden treasure? What is the purpose of going to those little houses? To get some rest. Oh, there's a door in the back. Yeah, I don't know. Well, it's going to prompt me if I can leave it. Enter oh, Sophia talk. Gate? No. Hello, I'm half secret area plus. <laughs> you have failed. Nope, no secret area. Okay, well, Paula and Catcher are just hanging out. Alright, well, ain't nothing else over here. Well, you might as well get on the boat. I guess we just, yeah, we just <laughs> leave them. Off we go then. Around here, so we're gonna go find Dest, is the next thing we're gonna do. Don't worry, Tiny, we're gonna get her back. Sophia Castle. Port Castle. Sophia Castle, enter. Can you enter? Yeah, because we already conquered it with Alm. Right. Alright, so yeah, and the treasure chest is actually open too, so that's kinda cool. Pleasure choice. Alright, now let's go. You better not go to Mila's temple. That area is crawling with Geezy's bandits. <laughs> There's geezers. 
A hero has arrived in Sofia. A We're controller saved. reveal? Of course. Super Nintendo USB controller. What do you mean USB? It's totally legit. 100% plugged in. 100, yep. Well, it is, but... 100% plugged in, but yeah. Hurrah, Sofia Castle is liberated. Dozer fled to his own lands. You Dozer. You better not. Dozer's gone, but crops are wilting and weird demons emerge. So What's strange. happened to the Earth Goddess Mila? You're, you're welcome, Zigo. I'm glad to provide controller reveals. I mean, that controller is whack. The controller is great. It's it's fantastic for old games. Like it this. has I love it. not let us down, Nelson. I love it. Sure, I'm happy, but I'm a bit worried that the Kingdom of Vergel might invade. Don't worry <laughs> about that. Poor Shannon. Those are escaped with a valuable royal sword. It was a gift from the French. Normal, normal, horsey. But sell it. I am not it. normal. I, am I not have normal. angel magic. I am angel magic. Hello. She is Angel Magic. License, Selica. It's been a while, eh? Grandfather, why are you here? Shining Force? Well, for many reasons. I see you've arrived safely. Yes, thanks to my allies. One fell on the floor, but oh well. We're all going to be less temple, even though everyone just told us not to. It's true. I see. Well, you might want to head upstairs first. You should find someone you've been wishing to meet. Can be, Alm. Ooh, Sophia's liberator couldn't be Alm, could it? Well, why don't you go see? Just leave. No. Uh, Not by Alm. Let's get some last moment eight bit plot here yes. before we. <gasps> We go and My the, love. We go and get it today on the top of the castle, boy. <laughs> on the floor, because there's no bed. Right here. Right on the ceiling. Right on the rooftop. Y you are... Z Zalika! Um, so it really was you. I haven't seen you since I left the village. Bitch, why are you leaving? Mm -hmm. They used to play together. Little pals. Yeah, we always used to play together. I had a serious grudge against Gramps that day you were sent away. I was sad too, but Grandfather told me why he did it. If you stay in Ram... Ram Village, yeah. Ram. Okay, if you stay in Ram, Dozer will come to kill you. But why? Why would Dozer want to kill you, Selica? That... I'm sorry, I'd rather not say right now. In any case, um, I have a request. Can war be avoided with the kingdom of Regal? That's impossible. King Rudolf of Regal decided to attack while well, Sophia is weak. At this rate, Sophia will be destroyed. But aren't we all the same? We should be able to coexist. So much more conversation than Fire Emblem 1. Yes. There's no way. Sophians won't tolerate Regal's barbaric rule. We must retaliate. How sad. I'm sure if we talked, we could come to an understanding. Unless, um, now that the Sophians call you their hero, you want to become their king as well? What? That's mean, Selica. That's mean. That's mean. You meanie. <laughs> COVID. You just. You're being mean. Meanie pants. Mm. 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 Okay, that's how it's he gonna go the, from he here on. Ready? He does that. I forgot I was wearing glasses, and I'm like, <laughs> okay, ready? I just want to protect people of Sophia. That's all. Besides, <laughs> Sophia's only remaining princess is still alive. I'm planning to search for her. After I find her, I'm returning to Ram. That's not true. Sophia's royal family is gone. I'm sweating doing this. <laughs> you're you're witnessing pouty children being petty. But I get it all. You go ahead to Regal. My companions and I are going to Mila's temple. Selica? He does a thing. But wait! Wait! Goodbye, Alm. <laughs> You have reached chapter two's end. Save your game. You have reached the 
petty squabbles end. Yes. Game save. Continue playing? No. Farewell. This, Zeke's, is how boys and girls end up in relationships because you know how it goes. When they're mean to you, that means they like you. That's right. Well, 